Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to demonstrate a new capability for consumer users uh, to be able to zoom the content of a canvas in a workbook. As you can see, I'm logged in as a consumer user and the header bar shows me a new zoom option which is enabled by the author when curating the presentation flow and present. Now before I explain the different options for zoom, let's actually go into the edit mode of the workbook and review the properties of the canvas. Canvas properties allows the author to define the layout styling as either auto fit or free form. And each of these width and height properties can be set to either screen, which is a screen size or to grow dynamically based on the screen size or a fixed size canvas, which is defined in terms in units of pixels. So you can see in my example that I've got 2000 pixels for my width and 1800 pixels for height. So when you have a fixed size canvas in your workbook, then that canvas is suitable for zoom controls at runtime. The way to set zoom controls for your consumer users is in present. So let's navigate to present and review the zoom control properties. A new section for zoom properties is added to present on the workbook canvas and by default is turned on. There are two primary properties. The first one is to control the scale. By default is set to the original 100% but the author can choose to either set it to fit to page or fit to width and then choose to expose the controls for the end user to interact with at runtime all. When the control is on, zoom controls will be exposed to the consumer user on the header bar and when the control is off, the zoom controls are not shown on the header bar and the workbook uses the default scale option set by the author in present. Now let's preview the workbook and load it as a consumer user would see. Uh, and you can see that the header bar displays the new zoom control options. Let's click on it. And there are two ways the consumer user can change the zoom of the content, either by a manual input here using the up and down arrow keys or the slider uh, allows the user to change uh, and expand up to 500 percentage of the original 100 percent size. Consumer users can also change the default scale option set by the author, in this case from original 100 percent to fit to page, at which point it uses the minimal width or height size from the canvas properties to fit the entire content into, into a page with no scroll experience. You can see that there are no horizontal or vertical scroll bars. Or the last option the consumer user can choose is to fit the content to the width, which uses the width size of the canvas uh, properties and the content is basically zoomed to that specific width size. Thank you for watching this video.